Hey guys, welcome back to Truth Talk. I have a topic today that has been popping up for me in the last couple of weeks and I thought it would be a good idea to address it here with you guys today. And the, the topic and the issue is what to do when um, you're faced with other people's opinions of what it is that you're doing. Um, and the biggest lesson about the whole subject is that it's none of your business. So basically, um, other people's opinions of what you're doing and, 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 and what you say or, or life choices doesn't matter is that it's really truly none of your business. Um, oftentimes when other people have an opinion uh, about something that you're doing, it it's more an indication of something within themselves that maybe they're feeling a discomfort or a fear or an insecurity. Um, and how this kind of came about was with um, my trip to, to Bali. I was kind of being faced with a lot of opinions that were being flown my way of, oh, don't you think that's a little bit far to go for 10 days? Or wow, you know, how much money are you spending for those 10 days or whatever? And my initial reaction on the inside was irritation. <laughs> I was a little frustrated and a little bit irritated about, you know, why can't I just enjoy the fact that I've booked a vacation for myself um, and, and by myself? And um, so that was like my initial internal reaction. Um, and then I just had to remind myself to just kind of take a breath and notice that that's, that's them and that's their stuff. And we all have our stuff. And then my external reaction was to just say, well, you know what, it's, it's good enough for me and it's what I can do right now. And, and, and that just kind of created a nice buffer between the opinion and, and, and my reaction and my feelings towards it. So not only is someone's opinion none of your business or a part of their stuff and their discomfort, but it can also be a reflection of a discomfort or an insecurity or a fear that you're feeling within yourself. Um, for the last year, I have been studying A Course in Miracles, which is a spiritual guide and a metaphysical text that was written by the Foundation of Inner Peace. And it is a textbook, a workbook, and a teaching guide. And so I've been incorporating the principles of A Course in Miracle in my everyday life as well as in my, my teaching practices with my students as well. And in A Course in Miracles, it says that we're not separate from one another. In fact, that we are, we are all one and we are all the same. And so taking the opportunity to notice um, that the other person is you and that their opinion um, could be a direct reflection of maybe something that is within you um, that you are failing to recognize or, or choosing to ignore within yourself. So this week, I guess the, the homework to do is to recognize and, and notice when you have those moments where someone is, is saying an opinion about uh, uh, maybe an event or, or something that you have said or something that you have done, and notice your initial reaction and, and what that invokes or evokes rather within yourself and, and take that opportunity to investigate further and dig deeper within yourself um, and and see what it is that that's in there that you are choosing to to ignore or that you need to um, notice and, and, and maybe work on um, or, or acknowledge and then process and let it go. So remembering that other people's opinions of who you are, what you say, or what you do is truly none of your business. And that will always help to um, just kind of release the, the opinion and, and, and then let that go and detach yourself from it. And then take the opportunity to, to see what it is within you that it's trying to tell you. What is it that you need to recognize within yourself um, with that? And really take the opportunity to investigate and grow and, and move forward and, and, and evolve um, to your, your truest self. So thank you so much for joining me today on Truth Talk. I hope I see you guys back uh, next week. And, and maybe leave a comment below. Let me know what it is that came up with you and, and what you think and, and how this week turned out with investigating inside when other people's opinions pop up. All right? So just remember that wherever you are in your journey, on or off your mat, that you're enough as you are, where you are, who you are today and every 
single day. And what other people say is just an opinion and it's none of your business. From my heart to each and every one of yours. Namaste. Thank you.